What's up guys, Sleeps here with another episode of my journey to an ultimate team and we start this episode off making a couple of fitness changes here and there. Uh, like I said, we're not really going to be able to play with the full starting gold 11 all the time. It's going to be really difficult to get them all in there, but uh, we have most of them in there. We only have basically we have all our golds on the left and a couple of bronzes on the right. So we searched for our first match and this guy was in a 4-4-1-1 with a La Liga slash Serie A attack. I mean, it was just all La Liga except for the attack. Uh, he had Balotelli up there, who was a very good striker in this game, and uh, get, getting a strong link through El Shadawi, who was out of position, but I, you know, I wouldn't imagine it's going to be that much of an issue. And uh, yet again, somehow, we score with the bronze striker. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> These bronzes just don't stop scoring. Uh, the bronze beast over here. Uh, right here, we play Marquisio in, and this is a very nice finish. I honestly did not expect him to finish on his uh, left foot, but he puts that one away low and in the corner nicely. So we're 3-0 up. You know, cruising along, I'm, I'm feeling good about this. A little roulette from Gabbiadini, and then look at that strike. I mean, Gabbiadini, guys. Gabbiadini is just so, so good. He is unreal. Like, it's getting to the point where I'm literally considering just putting, like, a, a finisher card on him or something and just keeping him for a while because he's just been, he's just been so clutch for me all the time. He's just always scoring. Look at that, man of the match and everything. Uh, Gabbiadini is just unreal, guys. He really, really is. Uh, I, and actually, I really love using him. That that attack with Gabbiadini and, and uh, Mirko just seems to be unstoppable. I don't know. But uh, now we're all ready for our second match of the episode after a couple of ch fitness changes here and there. As you see, we're going to have to sacrifice quite a few uh, positions on this one. But uh, nonetheless, as long as I have my two center backs, I feel okay. As long as I have my two center backs and my two strikers, I feel decent enough to go into a match. So we're going to search for that now. And I saw this guy's team name was Neymar FC, and I was like, please don't have Neymar. And sure enough, there he is, Neymar up top, partnered with Diego Costa, I think he had Thiago Silva in defense, a very, very strong team, but a chip through ball, and, you know, who, who else is going to score if not Gabbiadini, man, Gabbiadini's just so good, and he puts us up 1-0 in only, in just the second minute, it took us no time to score in this one, a chip through ball here, all the way out to Mirko, and Mirko, you just, you have to be finishing that, that kills me, but who's there to clean up? The one and only Gabbiadini, of course, very cool, calm, composed, just walks up, places it in the corner uh, you know great finish from him Gabbiadini cleaning up right there and then I gave himself I gave him a stupid goal here I mean I'm trying to defend this I get a touch on that and I didn't like his touch was so heavy after taking the ball that it just went right into Williams path nothing I can do and I mean the Williams not gonna miss from there that's such a simple finish but uh, right here the game is not over and Mirko's kind of redeeming himself here because he missed that you know he, he missed that one-on-one -on -one. and Mirko has to be put away and right there he dances through the defenders good control of the ball we, you know weaving in and out and there he is putting that one away nicely and uh, we now have a two-goal lead so I'm feeling a little bit better here chip through ball all uh, onto uh, Vucinic and he heads that like right onto the tips of, uh, I think he had Diego Alves and goal right onto the tips of Diego Alves goal and then in, ended up just going right back to him and he scores into the open net so we're winning 4-1 I'm feeling good guys uh, all we need is one more win after this to uh, get the title hopefully we can go ahead and do that in this episode but this guy you saw what he was doing there like right he, he stopped playing for a bit and the way I see it is like if you're gonna stop playing fair enough but what I hate is people who stop playing like see I just stopped playing too because I'm just wait wasting fitness and like wasting my effort trying to score with against somebody who's not playing I already had my max goal bonus but then this guy decides yeah I'm gonna just come back to the controller now and uh, okay then I'm, then I'm like fine if you're just gonna make me sit here not play for a while and then come back randomly then I'm just gonna go ahead and score so Mirko you know he didn't finish that one-on-one -on -one, but he came back with four goals so not bad and who is man of the match again guys who is man of the match Gabbiadini guys what a monster so as I said we only need one more win for the uh, division 7 title and that would be amazing guys the division 7 title uh, that would be three no what, what is it four titles in a row That'd be unreal, and a 20-game win streak. So I decided, you know what? I'm putting the entire goal starting 11, even though a couple players on, like, 88 fitness and, and whatnot. I was like, you're all going out there. You're all playing. But we come against yet another, you know, fairly strong team. This one wasn't as good as the others, but this guy was the best player I've played so far. Uh, very, very solid squad. And then right here, this is so frustrating because... Uh, right there I did not mean to obviously I didn't mean to slide tackle him right there what I did was I was I hit the clear clearance button and I wanted hit uh, Ogbonna there to clear on his first touch and then he loses the ball he ends up sliding and of course that's a pretty blatant PK when you look at it that way but I did not mean to do that that was just so dumb 
And it was a little frustrating, especially in a game like this. We really, really could use this win. So uh, Wayne Rooney steps up. I stay down the middle. He goes right. And there it is just like that. He is 1-0 up in the 12th minute. So we, we need to respond. We need to respond. We cannot stay down like this. That, that is just not going to go down well. So we play this through to Kone. Kone whips that in. And who's there? Mirko coming up with a clutch goal, guys. You know, I, I guess I really am talking about Gabby Dini a lot in this episode. But Mirko's always clutch. And Mirko's always great. So... Mirko gets us a goal right there, and then right here, so frustrating, I win this off Rooney, or I win this off whoever that was, it falls to Rooney, and then Rooney, man, what a strike, I, I can't, I, can't, I am mad at that goal, but at the same time, I'm kind of not, because uh, it, was, it was a very nice goal, you know, the strike was nice, and then right here, we're so lucky, I'm, I'm on ultra attacking, I think I just had a corner not too long ago, and so Ogbana was all the way up there, and Ogbana somehow finishes that one like a striker like it was such a good finish and I was so relieved because I'm like okay we are still in this game 2-2 and in the 90th minute Kone whips that in and who's there Gabby Adini the freaking legend Gabby Adini puts us up 3-2 in the 90th minute this guy had no chance to come back and that was the game and Gabby Adini again man of the match in all three games I mean this guy is just a monster so that is going to be it for this episode, guys. We take the title. We have 5,000 coins, plus what we have already. I think we're sitting on somewhere about 8,000 coins. So next episode, what we're going to do is we are going to go ahead and build our rotation squad so we can get the squad fitness going on, you know, like re keep resting each other, keep resting both of the squads. And then once we have a good, like, a good two teams going, then that's when, that's when it starts getting good and we can start getting our coins up and all that, and the series will start to get better and better. So... That is going to be it for this episode, guys. I hope you guys are enjoying the series. Please leave a like, leave a comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will catch you guys next time. Thanks for watching.